I just discovered the natural healing benefits of bath salts in this Greet the Season bath salt that I made all by myself. Let's make this Greet the Season bath salt so that you can have an amazing gift to give one of your loved ones. Hi, I'm Shyla. I'm a certified aromatherapist and I love teaching people how to use essential oils. So turn off those distractions because making is healing. So let's get started with this recipe. Before I tell you what you'll need, we at Simply Earth are super obsessed with teaching you how to use your essential oils. And that is why if you get our gift giving themed box, all that you'll need to make the recipe is in your box. Or you can also go to simplyearth.com to order some of the accessories. Here's what you'll need for this recipe. You're gonna grab your November recipe box as well as your big bonus box. First things first, you're gonna search for your recipe. It looks like we're gonna use lemon, winter spice, and nutmeg for our essential oils from this box. We are gonna use our cute little test tube container to put our bath salts in. And from our big bonus box, we're gonna use our almond oil. From your home, you're gonna grab some bath salts, and if you wanna add the Natrazorb bath powder to your recipe for an extra silky experience, you can do that as well. All right, for the first step, we're gonna add one tablespoon of almond oil. Okay, now we're gonna add four drops of lemon, one drop of nutmeg, and then two drops of our winter spice blend. All right, now we're gonna mix our almond oil and our essential oils together. And now I'm gonna add my Natrazor because I wanna be extra silky. I'm going to add one and a half tablespoons of the Natrazor. And then I'm gonna mix this together until it has a powder consistency. I'm gonna mix this together until it looks a little bit like the consistency of almond milk. And now I'm going to add three and a half tablespoons of Simply Earth's Dead Sea Salt mix. Okay, I'm gonna mix this up. I grabbed a few of the other salts that we offer on our website. So we also have pink Himalayan salts, a bath salt soak, and the dead sea salt. You can use whichever bath salt you wanna use for this recipe. I chose to use the dead sea salt, but you can choose the benefit that you would like for this recipe. All right, now that everything is mixed up, I'm gonna add it to my test tube and then we can label it when we're done with that. If the consistency of the recipe is just too thin for you or you want it a little bit thicker, you can add more of the bath salts and you can get the recipe to the consistency that you like. All right, now that my test tube is full, I'm gonna screw in the cap and then I'm gonna grab my label. All right, now that the label's on, don't forget to put your date so you know when you made your lovely creation. Let's test it out. I absolutely love using this bath soak because it's really great for your muscles, it smells amazing, and it makes a super cute gift. You can make this too. I love seeing all of your creations on social media, so go ahead and take a picture of your creation and tag from Simply Earth with the hashtag I made this so that we can see all your lovely recipes too. If you wanna learn how to turn essential oils into recipes like this Greet the Season bath salts, go ahead and get your Simply Earth recipe box today. We'll actually teach you how to unlock the power of natural ingredients from this box.